Greetings, everyone. It's time for some more Halo Wars. Uh, let's figure out what these gentlemen are doing first before I decide. We have an Anders. Now, my last choice was the Yap Yap. On my last game, that ended terribly. Not worth the uh, upload, unfortunately. Uh, looks like uh, we're going to go Yap Yap. Oh, he went to Rome. Okay. I worked out well. I hope you all are doing well today, this evening, this afternoon, this morning, wherever you are. It's time for some dad jokes. Of course, it's time for dad jokes. What do you think I am? Huh? Okay. First one. I applied to be a doorman, but I didn't get the job due to a lack of experience. That surprised me. I thought it was an entry-level position. The second one is, Doctor, I've broken my arm in several places. Doctor replies with, well, don't go to those places. That, I think it has to be my favorite dad joke thus far. It's absolutely perfect. I'm recording this, right? Yeah, I am. Just wanted to make sure. Uh, you want to know what else is perfect? Is the very bot that I get these jokes from. It's called Storehouse. You can add it to your Discord server. Link to that is down below. You should add it. It's really cool. It's really awesome. Coded, actually, by yours truly. I woke up one morning and I said, I want to make a Discord bot. And that's... Uh... I didn't make it in one morning. It was more like six months with the help of Pat, our admin extraordinaire. But uh, nonetheless, I did it. Didn't say I would do it in a day. Rome wasn't built in a day. So neither was Storehouse. Because they're quite equivalent, the two. <coughs> As you are well aware, of course. Oh! I really want to drop this. No one move. It's like right on the power crates. Oh, come on. Thank you. <laughs> what a perfect drop. No, the red health. You know, I don't do the yap yap rush very well. And I apologize. I mean, I got a starting grunt for that. For that drop. I mean, that's what, 40? for 150. I'd take that any day of the week. You know, the mine isn't as awesome as it as it goes off. When you upgraded it, it's really good. I, I don't know. It, it's kind of weak, but it, it's incredibly satisfying. So there, therefore, I recommend it. Does this man not know I can overwhelm him with cannon fodder very easily? It's a very poor decision. You're gonna run? Please get those supply crates. Yes! We got them, boys! A terrible decision. Actually, it's probably what I would have done, to be honest with you. Um, I'll make the build. As it's been dubbed. Yeah, see those those power crates are gone too, buddy. Alright, let's let's gather this node and then we're gonna go bother someone. And whenever I do this, it never works out. Like it's never successful. So watch as I say that, this one will end up being successful. He's got a lot of grunts, that's so a little alarming. I'm gonna go for UNSC. Is anyone playing as Forge? No. I'm going to go for Anders. Hmm. How about some please don't shoot me? I, I don't get that very often. I always get the same powers every time I play. And, you know, every once in a while, you're like, you know what? Enough. I'll just I'll do something different. Watch. He's going to have turrets up. I know it. Because whenever I play against Yap Yap, and they attack one of my uh, allies, no one has turrets up. But whenever I do it, they do. Show me the turrets. I know they're there. Oh, go for the gen. I only have three heavy grunts. And my, my pop is in cannon fodder. The, he the heavy grunts 
need to attack the gen. And the heavy grunts are attacking the ice blocks. This is like one of the most sad attacks I've ever seen. Yeah, see? Look, this is a waste of time. Can we get the gen? It actually went off. They didn't bother the mine. Get the gen. Stop attacking other things. I should be able to get this. I should go to Tech 2 while I'm doing this. Some guy's expert already on Tech 1. And he took the bad base. Okay. Yes, we got the gen. Well done. Oh, he just went to Tech 2. He's got three gens, though. Well, he had three gens, I should say. Lol. It's not worth a please don't shoot me, unfortunately. This can go away now. It can be a supply pad. Harvester or whatever. You know what I meant? It's an interesting build orientation. Very interesting. I have my global rally point over there. Let's move that here. That would be quite unfortunate. I'll upgrade this. Really, I really need supplies. There we go. I'm actually going to go run and get those supply crates because I need them. I wish it told you how many supply crates you gather like it does in Halo Wars 1. Oh, those snipers are in such a good spot. Oh, the Spartans. I'm on top of it. Wonderful. That ice cream truck's going to be a problem, but everything else stands no chance. The ice cream truck's one of my favorite. Oh, that's alarming. This is why you don't expo early, kids. Uh, foundry and raid camp. Oh, that's a load of garbage. Oh, it was good. Pavium dropped a heal on grunts? Question mark. <laughs> I would help, but I, I don't, I don't have anything. What do you want from me? I can go bother them with my grunt mechs, but they're just going to fall over. This is why you don't expo that early. I'm not going over there. I've changed my mind. I need to protect my... Selfishly need to protect my own base. <laughs> no, that's not nice. I, I just don't have the numbers. Halo Wars 2 is a numbers game if you watch our Mythbusters series. Uh... Mr. War Hero. Don't expo that early. I forbid you. It's your punishment. He's got NGs over there too. This guy's. This guy's ready. But once I get the Slash Storm launcher, we're going to be in good shape. Oh, Blue's going to come save the day. I, I mean, I'm not. I'm not trying to sound mean. I would go help, but I, it's just dumb for me to send my uh, grunt mechs over there to get obliterated like that. I just don't have an economy right now. I, mean, I could fill it up with some cannon fodder, I suppose. Now this I can handle. He capped it at, like, right before he uh, got annihilated there. Ah! You wasted your drop! Ah! We'll see you, nerd. We're gonna get grunts from above. Well, he didn't completely waste that drop. But I was able to pretty much decap that node in the meantime. In the meanwhile. Did I see Anders Siege? That's a rare sight to behold. 
You know, that used to be the meta, by the way, like, two years ago. Ender Siege was, like, OP. And it was awesome. It was like a, it was like one of those where were you when this happened kind of things. Oh, this is not allowed. Are you kidding me? You're right. I will waste all my drops on grunts because it's satisfying. No, you can't run. This makes it even worse. Does no one watch my videos? Running makes it worse. It's a rhetorical question, by the way. Um, does anyone... He lost his leader because of that. Oh, another... He's going to lose another leader. This guy wants to lose his leader. Everybody wants to lose a leader. This is exciting. It's like that Oprah meme. You lose a leader. You lose a leader. Everybody loses a leader. Anders has the best uh, UNSC hero, by the way, with the uh, Spartan. See, I told you I'd help that gentleman. And you didn't believe me. Now, can anyone go air? Not really. We're kind of all... Uh... I mean, they could go vultures, of course. What I mean is, like, Desi is like a clear indication that someone's going to go air. Just to make sure we're all healed and ready to go. Let's uh, put that there. See, everything ended up being okay. And this guy is making scorpions. It's Jerome, that's, that's an interesting move. I, I guess it would work out really well. You could do like Halo Wars 1 style. And you put the Spartans in the tanks. Like you get a mega team. That's kind of cool. What's going on over here? They, they like, ignore the... Where did the mine go? I dropped it. Where did it go? <laughs> did it just, like, not drop? Strange. You know, not a lot of people make wraiths in Halo Wars, and that's quite sad, because I love the wraiths in Halo Wars. That's a Vet 1 ice cream truck. That thing is tanky, by the way. I mean, look, it's just eating up. It is mostly infantry. He got combat techniques. Good on him. I don't have any drops. What's happening here? Mega turrets. Kind of ruins my race idea. We can't allow him to have this, though, because it would the mega turret spam would just never stop. He sent your rangers to my rangers. I think my rangers are going to win. We're running again. Oh, is there a good drop here? That leader's still going. I mean, there are, there are heals there. Okay, uh, let's get some upgrades here. Actually, let's cancel... What happened? <laughs> let's cancel this. I'll get that. I'm going to make a cloaking gen. And a couple of regular turrets. Someone's probably yelling at me about this problem here with the extractors. Ooh, is there a drop there? No, not really. That ice cream truck, uh, I think, kind of ate that army. Oh, we are going air. It's so depressing. Uh, fun fact. I, I think I say this every time I play as Yap Yap, but heavy grunts are great against air. It's like the... Kind of almost similar to the combat tech marines going against air if you're going to be UNSC, particularly Cutter. I love that Anders is setting up all this siege. That's that's great. I'm gonna protect this, by the way. You have my word. We're not taking the note. I don't get the idea. I don't under what's I don't understand what the what the game plan is here. Watch this. I, can, I have too many units. He's put all this work into it. I'll just do this. 
Boom, roasted. I, I heal is just so ridiculous. Do this on a scarab, and uh, you'll make someone ill in ways that has never been seen before. I have, like, way too many variations. I guess I can go send my uh, cannon fodder to go die. I'll just hold position them over there. They'll fulfill, they'll fulfill their title as cannon fodder pretty... Oh, yeah, let's go take on the ice cream truck. Ooh, let me uh, heal this. You, yes. I said I would protect you, sir. That Kodiak will live. Look how many supplies and power I'm floating. It's kind of ridiculous. There's a retriever right there. I'll drop the turrets. Ice cream truck is no more. There it goes. Oh, sorry, let's see if we can finish off this base. There we go. Oh, look at all this. I'll get the beam. Hey, oh, I was gonna beam if he was gonna sit there. Alas. Twist my arm. I'll make a scarab. Uh, I'm gonna make a vehicle upgrade. Is he not gonna get that base? The mega turrets are really doing work. I love mega turrets, by the way. It's got one. It's just so cool, like, of a design implementation. I it's completely borrowed from Halo Wars 1. The mega turret was a thing in uh, a couple of missions in Halo Wars 1, and I think one of the multiplayer maps had like a mega turret to whoever had line of sight, and the design is almost identical. But the, the idea to put it on a base, it kind of takes the idea of the shield generator in Halo Wars 1. Halo Wars 1, you can have shield generators. They were buildings, not turrets, and there would be some people who would troll the defense would stack. So if you really just wanted a base slot and you didn't care about getting any supplies or anything, you very well could just take a base and then expand it to seven slots and then put nothing but shield generators on it, and that thing was not going anywhere. Let's see what's happening here. Oh, my goodness, that's a waste, and I am so sorry. Well, we can get some line of sight from this. The guy, that's not a, it's not a recommended setup. I would sack one of these production buildings for another supply pack. You're not going to be able to afford anything. That's going to be GG's. Everyone's down to one base except for yellow. This game's going to be over before I can make my scarab, which usually is the case. Is that a Vet 2 Retriever Sentinel? Wow. guy in that mini base. I will give him credit. Uh, I can't believe I have a scarab in like this kind of nice army composition. Let's see. If, oh, and a condor. Well, well, well. I'll make a cloaking gen. I'll just stop that right there. You'd be amazed on just the idea of just having a cloaking generator has stopped an attack. Well, I'll just go over here and the guy will turn around. I, I think I'll go bother. I keep talking myself out of things. I'm going to go bother that mega turret. That base is not going to make it. But I'm totally going to get the grunt dome here. No, the base, please. I 
haven't really found it. That guy must not have not had any fortifications or uh, base upgrades. Get in, boys. I didn't lose anything taking out that base. That went away quick. Aha! Here we go. Now you can't leave. You've committed to it, sir? This thing's a little tanky when it gets vetted up like that. Two super units are running from a bunch of uh, marines. Or, uh, infantry, I should say. Now watch this. Operation Heal the Scarab. One more. And we're almost back at full health now with uh, no NGs are present. Alright, this is not nice. That scarab is going to live. I need NGs. Some wraiths. I have not gotten this upgrade. Run, boys. <laughs> oh, it's fine to let the scarab die. It's fine. Running never works anyway. As I stated earlier. That Condor. I don't have any anything that's really anti-air. Oh, he has two. I thought it was an optical illusion of some sort. Well. If that's the way we're going to play it. I'm having a power problem. Well, the goblins made it. Oh, that guy's wasted. That guy keeps sneaking up on uh, on people. Just heal. There we go. That healing is so good. Uh, we'll just make some reavers, wraiths. Uh, I like to make some heavy grunts. Could make another scarab. Did we not get? Did we get the base? Did we not get the base? What's happening? I can't tell. If it said that the guy quit or whatever, I I didn't see it. I think this is the end, though. I don't think they're going to be able to stop. Can we put the rally point on here, please? Please? There we go. Retriever's going down. I've never seen someone, like, uh, do this sort of strat. Where there are whole pops and condors and... I don't know why I'm trying to protect this. This is like nothing. The problem is, is that Reavers are kind of expensive. We've not gotten anything yet. <laughs> this hurts. There we go. No one's tripped that mine. I guess yellow quit. I don't know. Now he's over there. Actually, you you actually can. Oh, yeah. Let's heal that. You can have a pretty insane air force when you get condors uh, vetted up like that. The, but when you just run like that, it doesn't really work out. Okay, so that other guy has been eliminated. I probably should have just made all ravers. I don't know. I have nine heavy grunts. So I'm going to do the Y ability when I see those uh, air units. And we'll see what comes about with that. It's actually kind of props to that guy for having a... What, a vet two? 
retriever. I mean, those things are really weak. Just keep going. We can take out... Oh, so Pavum is still here. He just must have cloaked or something. I'll just take out this siege and we should be fine. Okay, for the next point... I think I want to make more turrets. The Reaver. And can I make another NG? I can. Let's do that. And the guy is not going to come over here. I'm assuming it's because he doesn't want to lose his air. That's kind of the problem. Is you uh, Once you lose your air, super units, you're kind of out of the game. We have too much here. I still have not dropped this uh, methane party. This is probably a good place to drop it. He's got two armories. I'm assuming that's so he can double pump uh, condors or something. Wow, I got that point quick. Uh, no, sir. Oh, so he must, he did lose that retriever at some point, because this one's not vetted, and I just got it with the beam. Pagum is the last to stand. Last guy alive. Don't know where the guy's going, you have no bases. I guess he's just waiting for the timer. Some siege there. No shield gem? Okay. Where's everyone going? This way. Look at all that siege. That's awesome. Job well done, sir. It's very rare that you see someone do this with their siege. And I'm so glad that, that he decided to do that. Anything I can do? Do that and then maybe he'll time out <laughs> yes it did work well done gentlemen wow 137 units with anders and 193 on this anders i believe if memory serves me right when you destroy a uh, sentinel that spawns with Anders' power, it it counts as a unit destroyed. So sometimes if you're playing as Anders or facing an Anders, you'll have a, a lot of units destroyed for that reason. That guy only built 15 units. <laughs> I think half of it were super units. Well, hopefully you enjoyed this one. It's an action-packed video this one was. If this is your first time around the channel, you can. Uh, I welcome you to join our Discord server. We have. Uh, we're trying to get to three thousand members of Halo Wars players. Uh, if you wanted to find someone to play a Halo Wars match with or against, you can uh, join our server. There's always someone there who will play with you. And I started a new channel. I don't know if it's uh, going to be a, a regular thing or not, but I, I started a channel dedicated to YouTube Shorts, the short-form content, less than a minute long, best viewed on your phone type of videos. They're vertical videos. Um, there is a link to Respawn Shorts is the name of the channel down in the description, and I'm doing one-minute videos based on the Halo Wars characters. That sounds quite cheddarful, huh? All right, thanks for watching, everyone. And I'll see you, James.